Mavs Lunas Macho Monday. Ian Torch here, and man, oh freaking man. Still reeling from last week. Kind of taking it easy this week. Got so many people on the shelf. Belts have changed hands. And I came in first place at least two weeks ago. That that gets a me prendi and giro for sure. Let's look at this. Okay. As of now, Buzzsaw, the former TV champion, is now the number one contender for the world champion. That is, unless Dark Invader says otherwise. Might have those two go at it if the world title isn't up for grabs. Average guy and laser put on a hell of a match. Interesting. Average guy actually lost against laser, but he's still in higher rankings. So I have to talk to the committee about that. But yes, Juan Tijuana, now the new champion, the new TV champion. Bobby Blitzworth, who got decimated by Dark Invader, is the number one contender. That's okay. That's kind of interesting. Buckingham's back in the running as well as Mandana. Now Chance Solar is now a contender. No, he, I think he was at a dark show and I just didn't catch it. Gothka now a number one contender after beating Mother Russia. People honestly thought a screw job was gonna happen there with Hammerhead. Side. And yes, he beats the Barbarian and Mighty Leo, the tag champs. Wait, wait. Dark Invader and Chance Solar is... I, I think there's been a misunderstanding there. But anyway... On with the matches. Let's get this going. But we do this at the Cattle Castle. Get the crowd to feast their eyes on some things. Let's take care of this ladies match first. Let's try out this kit pistol, but who's she going to face? Who is she going to step in the ring with? The Gorgon Tokoro. Pistol's got a bit of a mouth on her. So she's going to think about shooting on Gordon Tokoro before the match. Now, Gorgon doesn't need any sneaky tactics. She doesn't need a manager at ringside. And she feeds off the booze of the audience. Chance Solar. 
Oh, I think the... Yeah, he's on the shelf. Which really sucks. So, later, let's... Rogers is out with a busted elbow for four shows. Arizona, Arizona Chance Solars, you know, he's out for five. His back's all messed up. Buggy's got a busted ankle. Dizzy's out for three. Broken nose. Arabs work, working with rib injuries. Swears he'll be back in, after the next show. Buggy's arm's messed up. He's out for a show. is feeling awfully cocky today for some reason. Of course, Blitz has his partner at ringside. And Dark Invader has this Death Star Boy. I don't know what's going on with that. It's not sexist, it's just Kit Pistol was talking about cropping off Gorgon Tokoro's mop, so there we go with that. We well, got mid, mid Carters for this. All brute weapons. I don't need anything destroyed. more than brute force. somebody who's Geppetto gonna face
get that going. Insectoids against the bug buster. Let's party! Alright, let's get this underway, shall we, folks? Oh, this feud's picking back up, folks. It is that season, the bugs are starting to scurry in, and the extermination is on! Oh, look at Brute. Battering away. Oh, brute force wins. Crowd was not pleased by that. But here we go. Geppetto and Iron Mask back and forth. Oh! And the arm steal from Iron Mask. Shocking the crowd. Oh, Kit Pistol actually trying to fight back here. But the Gorgon just won't stay down. And the thighs of thunder win out in the end. Looks like Kit Pistol's getting a little bit of a shave. Oh, Crash is just in the middle of all this. But Blitzworth might have gotten his revenge. God, lost 285 in that one. Bugbuster traps him. Will he hit it? Yes! Extermination! That's it. One, two, three. It's just too powerful. He's setting his opponent up. Here it comes. Brute force. One, two, three. Iron Mask has got Geppetto. Rocco locked in. That's it. He's tapping his opponent out. It's over. That's a bit of a shocker. That's the Mi Prendi Giro right there. Oh, no. The match is over, and you know what that means. Kit Pistol is getting a haircut. not too affected by it. She wanted to go bald this week. There we go with that. Oh, came in second place. There we go. Well, that wraps it up for another Lunas Macho Monday. Don't forget, DZW's got a show the 19th. Domination Zone Wrestling on the 19th is their next show. We gotta find out what's going on, and I might be able to get an interview in there. Stay tuned on that. Aside from that, if there are any shows you know about that I need to keep my my ear to the ground about, you leave them in the comments. Until next time, I'm Ian Torch. This was Agroculture presents Lunas Macho Monday. And that's it. It's over. Ring the bell.